I've come down to beautiful North Severn for a couple of days away. While I'm here, I'll be doing lots of walking, checking out the stunning beaches and heading down to Ilfacombe to see Damien Hurst's sculpture, Verity. While I'm here, I'll also be checking out two very different campsites, which cater to different kinds of holiday. I've just arrived at Newbury Valley Campsite in Coombe Martin. It's a beautiful sheltered site and it's only five minutes walk from the beach. The site has a modest 110 pitches which are spaced out in terraces across the 60 acre site. Each pitch has electric hookup and easy access to fresh water and there is a mixture of hard standing and level grass pitches to choose from. The shower facilities are some of the most luxurious you will find with 11 individual shower rooms separate toilet and basin rooms and family bathroom. There is also a disabled shower room. All of the doorways in the halls in the shower block are designed for wheelchair access. In the main facilities block, there is also a washing up area which is kept clean and tidy with laundry facilities including an ironing board and iron. At the far end of the site, you will find a drive over waste point as well as port for those middle of the night trips. The site reception has a well-stocked shop with local products and gifts, as well as the basics. On site there is also recycling, a dog and wetsuit wash point, a children's play area, a fishing lake, woodland trails and a meadow. Because it's in a valley, the site is very sheltered and tranquil and it is perfectly located to explore Coombe Martin, just a five minute walk away. You also have a dog friendly beach within walking distance of the site and dogs are more than welcome on site but must be kept on leads. Barbecues are also allowed and the friendly wardens can provide blocks to place disposable barbecues on to protect the grass. While we were here we had a chat to some friendly motorhomers. We've been uh, motorhoming for about three months now. We've just come back from the beach, we've been for a walk down the beach. That's beautiful. Um, yeah, it's amazing. Barbecue tonight, a few beers. <laughs> <laughs> they were very pleasant in the um, and the reception. It's a really nice place. Uh, it's great, yeah, we've been coming here for a number of years now, um, about 10 years. Yeah, it's great, it's lovely, peaceful and friendly um, and always really well kept. Yeah, lovely and safe for the children, they can and run around and go to the park. And there's lots of space to play. <laughs> Which is the main thing, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, there's a really nice lake at the end, you can have a walk around. For me, probably it's the fabulous wash rooms and really clean facilities. Mm. I just think it's, it's lovely and peaceful, really. And you wake up and you hear kind of the, the, the sound tweeting. of the birds and the chickens and the the, um, the horses and the pigs, and it's just a really <laughs> yeah, lovely, peaceful nice. place. Great things about this site is you are so close to all the facilities of the beach and pubs and restaurants and things. So, um, but we really like that. The beach is really good for rock pooling, so the kids really love doing that. Day, <laughs> see if we can catch some crabs and some fish. <laughs> All in all, it's a lovely, peaceful site with luxury facilities and all you could need for a family break. I'm here at another great site in North Devon, Stowford Farm Meadows. It looks like a really lively site and is great for families. I certainly won't be short of entertainment. This family-friendly site is made up of five fields of both grass and hard standing pitches. Each field has its own facilities block, which are well cared for with plenty of cubicles so that you'll never have to queue for long. There is also a family bathroom. The facilities on site include a well-stocked shop, a caravan sales centre with a number of new and used motorhomes, a takeaway, restaurant and the main bar which serves food until 9.15pm. So you can still get fed and watered even if you are late back from a day's exploring. Evening entertainment is often held in the old barn bar, which also has a ball pit to keep the children entertained while you chat. For the kids, there are plenty of activities, including a heated indoor pool, nine hole pitch and putt golf, crazy golf, 800 acres of woodland, riding stables, petorama, an adventure play area, and plenty of green areas for playing safely. There are lots of dog walking areas, plus a day kennel in case you want to get out for the day without the dog. 
There is also lots of entertainment on site throughout the summer season, including bouncy castles, quiz nights and tractor rides. We spoke to some motorhomers to see what they think of the site. Well, I think the things we like about this site is that we, we like the countryside, so it's, it's the countryside side to it all. It's laid out fairly well, you know, there's plenty of room for everybody, I know it's, it's nicely spaced out. Yeah, I, mean, I think it's, it's, it's great. If you don't want to be beachy, because we live by the beach, so this is something different for us. So we live on the other side of Devon, but uh, so this is, this is a nice uh, contrast for us. And yeah, it is a site that I would come back to. Well, the thing I like best about the site is that there's, there's no regimentality with it. It's quite easy going, it's good for the dogs. Um, and apart from that, I mean, it's good value and it's clean, very clean. This popular site has tons to do and lots of options, no matter what the weather, for families and couples alike. I've had a really fantastic time here in North Devon and I've seen two great sites. I can't wait to come back and explore some more. <laughs>